Okay guys, welcome back to our Road to the Show MLB. Uh, this is our starting pitcher uh, career mode. Uh, we're one for one. I don't know, the last game, we never get the loss, we never get the win. Uh, so I don't know how that works, because I think we were tied after nine innings. I went to extra innings that game. So I don't know how that how that works to be honest. Uh, I'm not sure. I'm trying to even see our last but we were tied uh, at, at our guys on base. Uh, All right, tonight's double as I say, our guys tied the game at ninth and went to extra we innings. I think it went to the 14th inning or something. Show with the Bowman Prospect Spotlight. Darren McCall is our focus oh. as he's put together a pretty nice performance over the last month or so. Uh, EK, what's your take on his recent efforts? I forgot to set my timer yeah, because this is a uh, pitching which is sure. a little Played bit longer. Consistently and in the process, he's so. earned himself a nice little stat line. When you're in the minors, it's steady play like this that keeps your yeah, organization maybe need to take and people around baseball regarding a couple you as minutes a top off because I've he definitely appears to just started just the so timer, so I may even go a little bit conservative. Going forward, I like his chances. Of uh, here we go. Promoted. Let's get the ball rolling here. MLB The Show's coverage of minor league baseball is on the air as we continue our tour around the minor league. Tonight, the second of four to begin the week between We're actually the going to take some sunset pictures tonight. And the New Hampshire the sun's out. There's a bit it's of cloud. Baseball. It could be quite it's nice. The show, and it comes so, your way next. I might do that. Go for a walk. Justin Milano comes to the plate. Right, here to we go. Here the old Fisher Cats are playing. Center fielder, Justin Milano. Right. To short. It's actually been a couple of days since I've played it. this. Uh, to first by is so in time and that's I think, one. am I meant to go to home plate there? Yeah. look at how the home team lines up in this one. Anybody I mean, catch I'm your eye, Eric? Well, they got to love the production they're getting out of their leadoff hitter. First ball, first out. He's been a really tough bad. out this year, bringing an on-base percentage over 400 into the game. So I have a feeling he could be a key player in this one when it's all said and done. And we'll just off the outside corner for a ball, 1-0. and E.K. are visitors here as they take the field tonight following a scoreless top half. They come in looking to make it two in a row as they were winners last time out. And they've split the first four games on this road trip oh, so just low. lately two balls, they're in a no. bit of a holding pattern but See, the pitcher be ready to break the out catcher right wants it there but I don't know a strike and it's two and one oh, it's a just a bit high actually spot for that one I don't think it was by design it's one thing to miss your spots out of the zone but when you miss in the zone especially up that's when you tend to get hurt oh Sends on the ground one. out to second. Jackson scoops it up, two gets out. him two down. And with that, here's a look at the defense we'll see from Redding. It's well, we're not. We won't have five pitches. Eric, what so. do we need to know? Well, guys, this is one of the better defenses in all of the league. Oh, that's Very good clubs just, commit fewer errors. Just holds on to that edge. I expect them to be sound in this game. Inside fastball. And Whoa. that's inside off the plate with the fastball. It's one and one. See, I don't like that hanging as in the middle of the plate there. Yeah, no off of that, that one. Two balls and a strike. Aye. Tried to wait out the knuckleball, but it's in there. Two and two. Yeah, that finds a zone. Hey, come on. Let's go for a nice low a little pitch too much elevation. That could come back Fastball up high right in that edge. Frozen for strike three. Got the corner, so not too bad. And inning in the books tonight, still scoreless here on the show. Pretty decent first, first inning. AC Reed strides into no the score, box. so the team don't the get any runs. He's ready. Here's the first offering. 
And there's his strike right oh, down the heart of the plate, 0-1. Oh, and, and you know, I think it's going to be important that when guys get their pitches, they take Chip advantage. Here. There it looked like he was taken all the way, and he may not get another pitch that catches that much of the plate. Just a bit late, and he's falling behind, 0-2. Uh, see, I don't... I'd rather go for the corners. Here's a swing and a high pop up. up she Drifting pops. toward the third base dugout. And Whoa. this is taken in for out number one. Batting fifth, left fielder, Chris Kennedy. Chris Kennedy will stand in now, just a few ticks shy of the 300 mark for the season. Well, he's been hitting really well. Yeah, I don't like it. Game, oh, no, so uh, he's someone to watch out for in this one. First offering to him stays upstairs. It's a ball and no strikes. That'll be a souvenir, and the count will move to one and one. Oh, Ooh, just out Bottom of the second here with no score. Dave, is it far away for getting that? Oh, too high, too Very high. Very high, two and one. It's going to go Not an easy pitch to lay just off of, but up. he did somehow, and he's got it to three hate. and one. And that fastball, it's not coming in real hard, but... After you've seen a few knucklers, that's a tough pitch to adjust. Hit, to. And that finds some outfield grass. It's a base hit. Well, and when you face a knuckleballer, there's this sense. little voice in the back that's of your head that says, wait, no hat out the wait, window. wait. Apparently, he listened to that voice there. That's well done. See, he wants it there, but Pedro I mean, Gonzalez no, I'm sorry, takes I'm going. his first shot here with the runner at first nope. now and oh, one away. Knuckle ball below the knees, one and right, oh. Just missing that uh, speed here coming out of that left handed batter's box. So the ball, it's no sure bit, thing that a ground ball means a, a double ball. play. That's again, that's gonna check to swing there and pops this one up. And this is gonna wind up a foul ball. Runners on the move for second. Pitch is a cold strike. The throw way he's late, late, and he's in there easily. Pitch out second. there, but I'm I'm not real up to speed with that. And in a so. scoreless ball game, a lot of times it's a manufactured run that gets your guys on the board first, and they'll have an opportunity to do so now as he's in scoring position on the stolen base. One and two. Here it comes. Knuckle ball, and he Ooh. can't pull the trigger. Grabs it's a cold top, yeah. strike three for out number cool two. With that. Yeah, sometimes you just sit down, boy. And and he's thinking, how did that pitch wind up a strike? Just got to be thankful you don't see knuckleballers every day. I tell you one thing: that the, the pitching dynamic thing is really going. Stepping in now, up quite quick. <laughs> as he'll take a look at a high strike that time. It's nothing in one. Well, this is the kind of oh, situation where they came up short huh. last night. They had opportunities, but they could never really catch him. <coughs> oh, in, so excuse me. Oh, that's bad. Something going on the board early. <sighs> in there, and he's in control. Can he be a good sneeze? Now. Well, no taking now. He's going to have to swing the bat. Two out here and a runner at second. I must admit, I've done a travel. To work in the bus quite a lot, and I've been sitting in my territory. seat, and I've, I've sneezed. And, nope, this one falls, and you do so that sort of contained shot. sneeze. Yeah, you, know, you keep it in because obviously now you don't want to spray it to somebody that's sitting in front of you. So you can have uh, <coughs> that. You can have uh, keep it sort of contained. So no and and actually, no errors, and one man I've almost done my back in well, quite a few times doing that. I mean, you're always better to let it go, but sometimes you can't. So I've done that a few times and really kind of almost done my back in. Here we go, we've got third inning. I'm going down this corner. Oh, a bit high, but we might catch it quick. No yep. See, I, no, I'm sorry, son, I don't. That's better. Oh, and he's really getting the, the better of him oh, now. It's strike two. Right. See. On its way, the 0-2 pitch. A little bouncer. But that one rolls foul. Into the windup. Here comes the 0-2 pitch. And he won't offer it that. Too high. One and two. Oh. 
This one's blooped out toward right center field. Jackson Somebody's got it. into shallow right. And that's the first out of the inning. I have a 31 pitches. She's not bad. I mean, I suppose that's an average. Well, out of one out last but. night. That high. And that's Count high for a ball, 1 and 0. Oh. 8 minute mark. We'll probably call it quits at the 10, maybe. Or the 11, I don't know. High strike there, and it's one Mr. and one. Alignment, but Bottom of inning number three, nothing, nothing. Our score. Again, but very over that side. on the ground. That winds up foul for the second strike. Big swing Ooh. and a miss at the knuckler, and now they're swinging. Gone. Here's a close up of how yeah. he grips that knuckleball. You can see. It's not really his knuckles that grip the ball, but rather his fingernails that really dig into the seams. That's such a tough pitch to throw, and even more difficult to master. Justin Milano. He's right now. We well, just missed that a bit again. A cold strike, it's nothing in one. I'm going the corner. I don't like it. Hanging up in the middle. Oof. Off the plate and in. It's a ball and a strike. Bases are empty here with two men out. Can't keep the weight back, and he falls behind. Oh, he gets bat on it, but foul. Sky and tried to hold oh, up in nice. time, but to no avail as he went around, and the inning is over. Well, so that's that inning by. In this half inning, three innings complete, and we are tied, nothing, nothing. Okay, guys, I'll probably call it a day there uh, for this part. Alejandro Quinones is set to lead us Ooh, off so in the home half of the fourth inning. Well, they still don't have any runs on the I'll just board put it in yet. This screen. So this okay, guys, we'll, we'll call it a day there. Uh, so join us for part B of this game coming up, coming up next. So once again, thanks for watching, and I'll see you soon. Bye.